I bring in all the wishes and greetings to Dr. Dhruv Trivedi for scoring rank number 15 in MCH ENT group in NEET SS session 2023. Congratulations to you, Doctor. Thank you. Doctor, can I know your brief uh, history or where you started your career till date, what all you have done? Um, sure, sir. I, this is my first attempt of NEET SS. And uh, I finished my DNB this year. Uh, my practical exam was on August 24th. And initially NEET SS was planned on 9th and 10th uh, September. Correct. So I filled up the form, but uh, there was a deadline that uh, up to 30, 38 September, the result should have been declared off for DNB. Okay. So my results of DNB declared on 20th September. So I only had a period of 20 days to prepare for the exam. And uh, that's how I got the uh, 15th ranking in first letter. Great, doctor. Can you uh, can you tell us what all way you prepared to score such a good rank? Uh, sir, the, uh, there are two things. Uh, one is the app or the platform help me. And the other thing is simultaneously reading for the DNB helped me a lot. Because in DNB everything has been covered in the exam. So that helped me. And again, the discipline is always important for writing any exam. Main thing is the discipline. Ah, so main thing is uh, the platform helped me and uh, Teja search guidance. Main thing is Teja search guidance and, uh, and my two inspirations, my HOD sir, Dr. Nikhil Patel, who is my PG teacher and my parents. So these three are the main inspiration to excel in this field. And I always wanted to excel in the ENT and hidden work. So I was keen. I had no hopes to qualify for the exam because I was not sure of the uh, whether my results will be declared before 30th or not. But I kept on reading only. So, and the exam day was excellent for me. Very That's good, how it is. Very good, very good, uh, very good. Truly inspirational, truly inspirational. Uh, and uh, you have got it very nicely. And uh, how many questions did you attend? Uh, I attended, sir, 142 questions. Uh, and eight I skipped because I was not, not completely sure of this. Okay. So what is the message that you want to give to the aspirants of uh, Hyrenic Oncology? Uh, sir, the message is during, if you want to clear in the first attempt, always be clear with your basics during the residency only. If your basics are weak, then it is difficult to clear in the first attempt. Otherwise, it will take one or two years to clear the basics of Hyrenic Oncology. And you should have a proper guidance and a proper inspiration to clear the exam. Without inspiration and blessings, you cannot clear anything in this world. It's like you cannot achieve anything without blessings. Very true, doctor. Now, time to thank whom all you want to thank that they have helped you to come to this level of your career. You can do using this platform. Sure, sir. First of all, my parents and uh, my sister. Second is, uh, again, sir, I will tell my PG teacher, Dr. Nikhil, sir, and uh, uh, my seniors who helped me to clear the concepts and Teja, sir. Teja, sir, was 24 by 7 available. I don't know how he does that. But yeah. anytime you message him, he is always available to clear a doubt, answer, and guide. So these three things, I want to thank them by whole heart about. Uh, it's because of them I am here. It's like that. Not only me. Great, doctor. Wonderful, wonderful. Nice to hear from you. And once again, we wish you uh, all the best and a great success in your career of Thank MCH you. Head and Oncology. And as an Head and Oncology, you're going to do great services to people who are going to come to you for their advanced wishes and uh, great success to you. All the best. Thank you, sir. Welcome, doctor.